Hey, what's up, guys? It's Koopo here. Uh, today I'm going to show you uh, what I do to learn hotkeys. Uh, hotkeys are really important because if you're not looking at the screen at the boss and you're looking down at your at your keyboard, uh, you know that's when you're standing in the fire. That's when you're getting hit by mechanics and everybody hates you. Um, and also, uh, just knowing your hotkeys should help your DPS tremendously. Um, I'm really against clicking. Some people, uh, I've I've known clickers that are very good, but there's it's always a crutch on you. Like there's always going to be situations where you're going to wish that you knew your hotkeys. So uh, everybody who wants to raid, I really feel needs to learn all their hotkeys. So I'm going to just kind of show you what I've done uh, to to progressively learn my hotkeys. It's been a long uh, a long learning period for me to learn all my hotkeys. And uh, so obviously. You know, when you first start gaming, you learn the WASD keys, you know, it's kind of your movement keys. And so everybody should really be familiar with that. And then, um, obviously, uh, your 1 through, I'd say 1 through 5 are very easy for you to press. So you should learn your 1 through 5. I usually like my main rotation skills on my 1 through 5. Um, and then after 1 through 5, you can go further if you want to, but I don't suggest it. It's because the main idea for me is you do not want your hand to leave the WASD keys because then you kind of hinder your movement. Like, you always need to be mobile. And uh, look at this hunter. He's like, I'm a hunter. I kill everything. Um, but anyway, you don't want to move your hand from the WASD keys as best as possible. So that's kind of where I like to keep my hand. So the next set of hotkeys that I had to really teach myself was the shift keys. So um, on my bar here, it's shift 1 through 5 are bound. And so you just want to play around with those as best you can. Uh, just start binding them and start using them. Um, it's just how the brain works. It's basic psychology. It's not too crazy. Uh, your your brain makes the connection that, hey, when this skills up, I need to push this key. And the more times that you use that, your brain will start get better at making that connection the more times you do it. So when you're learning hotkeys, it really is. It's repetition, repetition, repetition. And also, it's putting your hotkeys in an appropriate place. Like I said, you kind of want them by the WASD key, so, you're, so you always are able to do movement. Um... So you can start learning with your shift keys. Uh, people use their alt keys and their control keys also. And so uh, I, I also do that. Um, it, it actually took me quite a while to learn the alt, uh, the control keys. Alt wasn't that bad because your thumb's like right there. But the alt keys, uh, or, I'm sorry, control keys took me a while to learn. And um, one trick uh, that you might want to try for learning uh, some of these little bit harder keys like the control key and the uh, alt key would be uh, what I did is I actually used to replace my shift keys with the uh, with the control keys and then that because my, my, my mind already kind of knew how to use those keys or those hot keys and uh, it just it helped me out to make that connection just do what you got to do to make that connection but in the end of the day just know that it's uh, it's repetition so don't get discouraged with it. Just bind it and start using it. Um, you know, practice, practice, practice. You know. Um, I'm trying to think what else that you guys need to know. Um, there's a lot of helpful things you can do, like the, to track cooldowns. Like, see this right here? The prismatic crystal just popped up. It says prismatic crystal. That's my trinket. My trinket just procced on um, the crystal. And, and that's called a weak aura, if you don't know. And you can download, it's called Weak Auras 2. And you can make little Weak Auras that'll show up on your screen when cooldowns are coming off cooldown. And it's just a helpful tracking tool. And I highly suggest getting it. I should probably uh, download some more of those for myself even. Um, and that's something I'll do in the near future. Uh, gosh. I think that's about it, guys. Just practice, practice. Make that connection to your mind. The repetition. And uh, you'll be you know, way better off as a raider and people will like you a lot more. Don't be that guy standing in the fire, okay? Um, and I really want, and you know, the reason why I wanted to make this video is because uh, I, I used to run a raid guild not too long ago, and uh, I just couldn't find any good raiders, man. Like, people just standing and everything, and like you get them their full tier with their class trinkets, and they're pulling 20k DPS? Really? 20k DPS? But anyway, you don't want to hear all that. <laughs> Um, 
thanks guys and I hope this is a little helpful to you and uh, please uh, comment and uh, like and subscribe